All right, S Salman, um, do you think Pacquiao was right to move on from Floyd Mayweather? He was obviously wanted that fight with Floyd Money Mayweather, and uh, Pacquiao's now moved on. It looks like he's fighting Keith Thurman. Do you think that Floyd Mayweather fight was never going to happen, and Pacquiao was right now to make a decision and move on with the, with his career? I agree. Um, I, 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 I think Pacquiao... Him wanting to fight Floyd Mayweather is stupid because you've got to realise Floyd Mayweather has made his money in the sport. He doesn't need to come back. He doesn't want to come back. Even if he does want to come back, it's for the money. Um, he's always fought for the money. If he knows that he's going to go for a three-round spar and get 10, 10 million, he's going to do that. It doesn't make sense for him to go in a competitive fight, work his body so hard to get into sh shape because him to fight Pacquiao, even though he beat Pacquiao the first time, if he just comes out of shape, Pacquiao will beat him. Because you've got to realise in that Pacquiao fight, Mayweather was on point. His skill set was on point. That's why he beat Pacquiao. If his skill set's not on point, he isn't going to beat Manny Pacquiao. Because Manny Pacquiao's a very good fighter. Do you know? He's a very, very good fighter. But in terms of him moving on, I think it was the correct decision. If he really wants to cement his place in the, you know... He's, still, he's a Hall of Famer regardless. But if he really, really wants to start, like literally cement his place... If he was to go on then to beat Sean Porter, Terence Crawford, Errol Spence, then he'll be rated as, you know, because these guys have never been dropped. They're, they're under, unbeaten fighters. The guys he fought and beat, I don't think they were unbeaten. They had been beat. These guys are unbeaten and people say Terence Crawford is the next thing after Mayweather. You know, even, even Timothy Bradley said for Terence Crawford, I wasn't even as half as good as Terence Crawford was. And I've seen that in the Khan fight as well. Those guys are Terence Crawford's a very good fighter. Um, whether I don't, I don't, I don't say he's leaps and bounds ahead of the rest or the other true other elite welterweights. But I think Manny Pacquiao, in terms of Manny Pacquiao, I think he's definitely made the right decision on just you know forgetting about the Mayweather fight because it was never going to happen. Mayweather's not going to come out. He's already beaten him once. He doesn't have anything to prove. Um, and he's cashed out for the Pacquiao win. Um, but I think Pacquiao should fight Sean Porter, Keith Thurman, Danny Garcia, um, and Terence Crawford. So, the, and Errol Spence. So, in terms of uh, Mayweather, you think that if Pacquiao beats Keith Thurman, there's no chance of Pacquiao fighting Mayweather in in in, in the foreseeable future? No. Even even a report asked Mayweather, "Oh Mayweather, why don't you fight Keith Thurman?" Like. Mayweather even just said straight that why do I need Keith Thurman? Who's Keith Thurman? Like he's nobody, you know. All right, guys, there you have it. We're giving our thoughts. Uh, looks like Pacquiao's moved on for Mayweather. Doesn't look like that rematch is ever gonna happen. I know you fans want to see it, but some of you want to see it. But it just looks like you know Pacquiao Mayweather is probably past his sell by date. Leave your thoughts, guys. And guys, remember to please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.